Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand, this review is about BMS College of Engineering and I'm going to share the details about the placements which is available, right? So BMS College does, does not have the latest information on 2023 and this article mentions that 1000 offers were made by, you know, uh, February. So uh, by now, you know, almost like 13 to 1400 offers would have been completed already and uh, this is what BMS CE placement officer has said. So I will start with the NIRF data, which is uh, uh, you know, for last three years performance. So if you see for the batch passing 20, right, for that batch, 961 students were eligible to participate in placements and out of which 759 students got placed. So almost uh, with a very good median salary of 7.6 lakhs. Uh, next year in 21 passing batch 962 of students were eligible and out of which 803 got placed and the median salary was again excellent 8 lakhs and the next year which is the latest media and report 2022 where 1046 students were eligible and 864 of them got placed with the median salary of 8.24 lakhs so median salary of is going excellent trend and i can believe that in 2023 the median salary would be around 8.5 lakhs but data data or details are still not available for 2023 now talking about the branch wise placement so this data is coming from the mandatory disclosure report right which every college is supposed to give to the government for the last three year placement so here also 2022 data is not available but for 2021 up to 2021 all the data about the placements in different branches is available so i'm taking from that annexer so if you see this branch is civil engineering so civil engineering has total strength of 120 students and it talks about the different cutoff marks for civil in three years right but the placement information is in the last uh, section you see here the civil engineering in the latest batch 2021 the minimum salary was three lakhs for the civil engineer maximum salary in the civil engineering branch was 12.5 lakhs and the average salary was 5.82 lakhs so close to 6 lakhs was the average salary in the 2021 batch right which is the information available as of now the next one is you see computer science engineering branch again you can see cutoff of all the years and the total number of seats in csc is 210 if you see the 2021 data here right you will find that the maximum salary in 2021 was 32 lakhs and the average salary for computer science branch was 10.37 lakhs so that was in 21 so by 2033 uh, in the latest batch it would have reached around 14 to 15 lakhs you can believe that and maximum salary was 32 lakhs and the minimum was 3.5 lakhs so that was the computer science engineering in 2021 again in the next branch is electronics and telecommunication you see at the bottom so for electronics and telecommunication the maximum salary was 12.63 lakhs in 2021 and the average salary was 6.77 lakhs and the minimum salary was 3.8 lakhs and the number of seats in ete which is electronics and telecommunication is 60 now if you talk about the next branch which is mechanical engineering again this is 2021 data you can see maximum salary for mechanical engineering was 23 average salary was 6.17 and the minimum was 3.5 lakhs total number of seats in mechanical engineering is 120 the next branch is electrical and electronics engineering you can see here in 2021 batch the to seat was total number of seats was 60 and the maximum salary was 23 lakhs and the average salary was 6.75 lakhs and the minimum salary 3.5 lakhs almost similar like mechanical now if you move to the next branch which is ece electronics and telecommunication engineering total seats 210 and for 2021 batch the highest salary was 30 lakhs average salary was 7.22 lakhs and minimum 3 so by now 2023 the average salary would have moved from 7.22 to 10 lakhs so ece's average salary will be around 10 lakhs next branch is industrial and engineering industrial engineering and management iem so there also you can see the maximum salary was 12.5 lakhs average salary 6.69 lakhs and the minimum salary around 3.96 lakhs so total number of seats are 60 and if you want to see two more uh, earlier years like 20 performance and 2019 performance is also mentioned in every column there now next branch is information science engineering isc and for isc the maximum salary was 32 lakhs 
एवरेज सैलरी टेन पॉइंट एट टू लैक्स सो आई एस सी सैलरी वुड नाउ बी अराउंड फोर्टीन टू फिफ्टीन लैक्स एट लीस्ट इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड द मिनिमम सैलरी वॉज थ्री पॉइंट फाइव लैक्स टोटल नंबर ऑफ सीट्स आर वन एटी द नेक्स्ट ब्रांच इज इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन इंजीनियरिंग टोटल नंबर ऑफ सीट्स आर लाइक सिक्सटी इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन बैच राइट द मैक्सिमम सैलरी वॉज जस्ट एट लैक्स एंड द एवरेज सैलरी वॉज फाइव पॉइंट सेवन लैक्स एंड द मिनिमम सैलरी वॉज थ्री पॉइंट एट लैक्स दिस इज इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन ब्रांच प्रीवियस टू प्रीवियस ईयर ऑल्सो यू कैन सी द मैक्सिम सैलरी वॉज नाइन पॉइंट फाइव लैक्स एंड इन टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन द मैक्सिम सैलरी वॉज टेन लैक्स सो दिस ब्रांच मैक्सिम सैलरी इज अराउंड टेन लैक्स एवरेज सैलरी अराउंड फाइव पॉइंट सेवन लैक्स बट नाउ इट वुड हैव इनक्रीज टू सिक्स टू सिक्स एंड हाफ लैक्स एट लीस्ट द नेक्स्ट ब्रांच इज मेडिकल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स तो टोटल नंबर ऑफ सीट्स अगेन सिक्सटी हाइएस्ट सैलरी इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन बैच वॉज सेवन पॉइंट सिक्स लैक्स एवरेज सैलरी वॉज फाइव पॉइंट वन सिक्स लैक्स मिनिमम अराउंड थ्री पॉइंट एट लैक्स द नेक्स्ट ब्रांच इज बायोटेक्नोलॉजी सिक्सटी सीट्स मैक्सिमम सैलरी वॉज ट्वेल्व लैक्स इन एवरेज सैलरी सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स सेवन लैक्स एंड द मिनिमम सैलरी वॉज टू पॉइंट सिक्स फोर लैक्स नेक्स्ट ब्रांच यू कैन सी हियर इज केमिकल इंजीनियरिंग सिक्सटी सीट्स मैक्सिमम सैलरी एट पॉइंट फाइव लैक्स एंड द एवरेज सैलरी फाइव पॉइंट फोर फाइव लैक्स एंड टोटल नंबर ऑफ सीट्स आर सिक्सटी एंड मिनिमम इज थ्री पॉइंट एट लैक्स फॉर केमिकल नाउ यू कैन सी अबाउट द एरोस्पेस इंजीनियरिंग देर इज नो प्लेसमेंट ट्रैक रिकॉर्ड मैंशन हियर and the only cutoffs are mentioned similarly artificial intelligence is also a new branch in this college so ai ml also there is only cutoff mentioned for last 3 years there is no placement have which has happened for ai ml branch so that's a branch wise performance in 2021 and you can believe that at least 20 to 30% more in 2023 right so which the data has is not there but i will make another video when data will be available that's all i have to cover thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates take care